G'day guys, so as promised, here's another trapping video. So people requested I do this after I first showed it on the Witch's Sickle Quest, it was the last stage, where they'd had to run up to this building, look inside, and when they jumped in to try and use that ladder, They found the ladder wouldn't work for them, so they were stuck down the bottom of the tower. So, let's see how that was done. So, I'll first lay some foundation down. And on this furthest right foundation, I'm going to place a wall, but before I place it down, I'm going to press the Y button, which is the flip button. So now it's snapped to that right hand foundation, but the outside of the wall is facing inwards. Now if I place a ceiling over that middle foundation, that ceiling is going to be pulled to the right hand side. Now place a ladder on the side of that ceiling. There will be two snap points, make sure it's on the outside one. And another ladder down, make sure it's in line with the top one. And now get rid of the thatch. Okay, so now you can place your walls like you normally would. So snap to that middle foundation. Now box the bottom of the ladder in. and a door for access. A ramp up the side and a ceiling off the top of the ladder. That'll be used to hold our bait. So place whatever you want up on top of this ceiling. I'll just use a large storage box. And get rid of that ladder. Okay, so this is the trap in its most basic of forms. They walk up the ramp, jump down, assuming they can use the ladder to reach that box, but the ladder doesn't work. And they're trapped inside that box. So since the top's open, you can't very well just put a trip wire down inside there. So I think a rabid dodo is the best option to alert you that, that someone's been trapped. So we'll just extend it one square so we can hold the dodo without it being seen. So now you can throw a dodo back here, set it to aggressive and when it attacks and dies, you'll know someone's in the trap. Now there was another part to that witch's sickle stage where they had to find a hidden ladder to get out of that pit. So while this isn't used for trapping, it's um I'll just quickly cover it now so I don't get any questions on that. Before jumping over to the official servers and trapping some people. The hidden ladder only really works in stone, so I'll put a foundation down. A thatch wall up at the side, but flip it around using the Y button, so the outside faces in. A thatch ceiling back. And now this time when you place the ladder, of the two snap points, choose the inside one. And extend the ladder down. The thatch is no longer needed. And now when you put a wall down, it has to be stone. 
it'll conceal the ladder. But you'll still be able to grab and climb up it. And you can see they're embedded in the outside of the wall. So that covers the two ways I used to place the ladders. There is another way of concealing the ladder, but it has its issues. So place the ladder on the outside snap point of a foundation. Place another foundation next to it. And now you can place a wall on the second foundation. Flip it around using the Y button. So that's a hidden ladder on the outside of a wall. But you can see how you get hung up where the walls transition. It's a bit of a pain in the ass. I don't really bother with this. Anyway, let's go check one of these traps on the official servers. So I just received notification from one of the dodos that had died that someone was in the trap. <laughs> and there he is there. So this is the same trap we made earlier, just with the smithy up the top as bait. Just with the structure being a little bit more significant. Which would be expanded on later. Here another dodo alarm has just died, so I know someone's in the trap. So, looks like another beach noob. And here's another dodo going off. Using the dodos gives you some indication of what you're in for, so it's only a human, level 8, so another beach noob's going to be in the trap. So let's go check it. Shoot him in the balls. This time I'd chucked a tripwire alarm and a narcotic tripwire into the trap. So you get that alert in the chat. Although it doesn't say who tripped it like it does when it, they have to kill a dodo. Since there was a narc trap in there as well, he's been knocked out. And the aggressive dodos have killed him. And looted his body. Now this clip shows the only time I actually physically saw someone walking into the trap. And that's because it was a beach runner with a torch on.
and he's up in straight in and of course he has to fiddle with me forge which I left in there just for light to lure people in and now he's found the aggressive dodos behind that thatch wall he tries the ladder he can't get up so he starts hacking into the dodos but me tried mate got in there before he killed the dodos and got him Another check trap dodo goes down. I like it when they're a higher level, so 69 in this case. So the trap has become a little bit more elaborate now. Where we can sit and play with him a little bit. I may have fell. Yeah, I'm sure it was an innocent fall. Then you kill me, Dodo. I've installed some plants there to keep him back off the railing. I like seeing people helpless. Now in its final form this trap got even more elaborate with five different means of execution. So up the top I had the giant hatch frame to drop larger dinosaurs down onto them. I only had a high uni in there at this time. Behind the four stone doors I had plant X. Behind the double stack door I could hold packies, uh, draptors, terror birds, um, hyenas that come out there as well. And the single door for the dilos. And smaller shoulder mounts. Up the top above us was the doors holding the auto turrets. And that's the giant hatch frame from the bottom. All controlled from a keypad in the viewing area behind that railing. So that packy looks like it wants a bit of action. <laughs> One hit KO. And I'm just running one of the old accounts here as an ally. And just trapped another guy. <laughs> he thought he was smart finding the blind spot. To cover everywhere with the plants, he'd probably need a C shape, like two on one side, then one up each of the other sides. Anyway, that's it for the trap, guys. So, in other server news, um, thanks for the fight, Frozen. You may have lost the 
server war, but I'm sure the cluster war will continue. <laughs>